Hello everyone, it's your host, Cyber, and welcome to another video. I'm going to be staring at my screen for the entire amount of video unless I need to look at the camera. But um, the camera is like right up here, as uh, above my monitor. Um, so I, I'm just looking at my screen simply so I can keep uh, um, check on the video so the video doesn't skip or something doesn't go wrong with my camera while I record. Um, I can monitor everything through just through this video. And I would do this on my on, on the table, but I didn't want to take my camera out and do all that. So I'm just going to basically just do it in this format. And I know that this is going to be a really great video because it's about practically about headphones. And I'm wearing my own headphones. Um, so, I, I, so, yeah, I want to say thank you to Vectors. Um, I think it's called Valor, Valorize um, for sending this product out. This video is sponsored by them. Um, to open box uh, open have an open box experience and opening a box experience and you know allowing me to review this product um so hopefully everything goes well in this video um i'm going to split this in multiple parts but i'm going to fully edit it to ensure that you know they're all matched up together one so that i'm not like you know it's all crazy and i can just show up different aspects including how, how they sound so and how they sound via mic and this is going to be my full honest review. I'm not going to sugarcoat it. You know me. Uh, whatever you hear in this video, you can determine whether if you want to, if it's this mic, this headphones are for you. Uh, I don't know because I have some big ears, so I can, can see. I have these things, and I have like with these headphones, I got to push my ear inwards. So, yeah, it's not like a big around headphones. I, I like the Turtle Beach ones, but they have like the uh, Turtle Beach ones was the mic was terrible. It had like a lot of staticky and people would hear it could be a constant issue. But this mic, I had a really good success with talking with my friends with, and I had this for quite a while. So this is the product I'm going to be unboxing. Um, also, I do apologize if you've seen any mess in the background. I have two have children, and um, being a stay-at-home dad, kind of uh, a lot of work. But um, Valorize, Valorize um, sent me this headphones um, for for free. I they're sponsoring this video, and it looks just like this. This is the box that you will receive it in. It usually will come wrapped up. I took the wrapping off just simply because I don't have to worry about it later um, when I do when I did this video. But I haven't opened it yet at all. Um, so this is the first time actually opening up the box. So let's get started. So so let's see. So the basic functions of this, of, of this, what it says on the box, I'm reading off the box, so, um, is the basic function 7.1, surround sound with immersive experience, glowing LED lights, three types of connectivity. I'm actually kind of curious about that. Um, noise canceling microphone, which I'm also curious about that. Um, one click to mute, a USB-C transmitter with a USB-A adapter. I do have a USB-C port, so I'm not, I don't know how to use the adapter. Um, the product parameters is a the, the received distance is about 10 meter, 10 meters. And speaker size is about 40 millimeters. Frequency range is about 20 hertz to 20 kilohertz. Um, speaker sensitivity is 103 plus 3 decibels, and the speaker admittance is about 32 watts. Actually, that's actually a pretty impressive. I have I think I have like a 80 watt speaker system. This is, this is not my headphones. My speaker system from Logitech, and I think this is like the, the best as my Logitech system by no means. But or 32 watt speaker system is pretty good. Um, uh, microphone 70, 70 sensitivity is between 42 decibels to 3 plus 3 decibels. Working current is about 12 to 100 milliamps, and the charging voltage is 5 volts. It has it comes into two, many languages, two three languages. Three languages, English, and I think that's Chinese, I believe. Um, I'll have the link. This does work on the, for the PS, PS3, PS4, and PC. So you guys can definitely check that out. Um, so we're going to try to unbox this. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to unbox it on here, on, on my desk, because um, my camera doesn't go further distance down, and I don't have the equipment to do that. Kind of disappointing, is it? And plus, I really need two hands, so I really can't go ahead 
and unbox it. So here we go. So I got it off. There's something in this side. We're gonna put this to the side. So what you receive in this box is I'm gonna what you receive in this box is here's the headphones. It looks like this. Um, you'll get a card. This is I'm not gonna show this just because I'm not gonna show the other side because I don't want if I have to submit this. I don't want it being used by you know online people. So this is a basic card where you can you can register your 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 headphones for warranty. You get the head. It comes with the headphones. Look, they look it comes with the headphones. And it comes with a USB dongle. Now I don't know if there's anything beyond this box. So I'm gonna check just in case. Yes, under here comes with the cables necessary for the headphones. That's all that comes in with the with the uh, the headphones. I wish it did come with like some kind of booklets, like manual, like regarding that that discusses about warranty, liabilities, and exactly how to set up a microphone. That would have been really nice. So here's the here's the microphone. Here here's that not the microphone. Here's the USB headset. I don't know what this thing is for. I'm curious. Okay, let's see. This is the USB port. All right, so this comes in two different ports. Like, so here is the USB. I think this is a really nice design. I really think that's a really nice design, to be honest, because it fits on my case like really nice. But I don't know about this. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why there's a clear thing on here. I just don't know. But I'm not gonna complain. So. I'm gonna put this back in here so I don't lose it. And now I'm gonna put this right here. So onto the headphones. The headphone comes protective in these kind of covers. Oh. So they look like this. They twist around for like a thing. I don't know how comfortable these are. They look comfortable because they feel squishy compared to my like already old ones, old headphones. Uh, these feel much more cushiony than these ones. So it has, so it has little buttons on here. Like I can show you. Um, so it has the. I'm not sure what this one, this one is. This one's the mute mic button right here. You have the volume rocker, and the and the, and you also have the power button, and you have also a port for your head for your headset. On the other side, you have another mute button. I don't know if that's a mode. I think that's a mode button. And then I'm assuming this one does has nothing on, on the other end, but it has a USB type C charger port, so you can literally um, charge the headphones. Um, the mic comes extendable. It is not, I don't believe it's removable, but I wish it did come with like a uh, a filter, so this way it can block out outside noise. I know the noise canceling may be great too, so uh, hopefully. Everything goes great. So let's see how the headphones. So that's what actually before I actually get to that, I want to show you how my 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 my, uh, my thoughts on the build quality. The build quality feels actually really nice. I wouldn't say it's metallic like my my Kraken um Razer Kitty Kraken um headphones, but they feel pretty well built. Um, more of like a smooth kind of texture, no rough edges, everything feels nice. It does kind of feel like on some aspects of it, like it was low quality built for plastic. Like the plastic was refined to look and sound, look feel as robust and really nice. But does that look like it's gonna break at some point? Like if I do this, is it gonna break? I have no idea. I've owned these before, so they look pretty nice so far. So I'm going to what, let's go. So let's go test them out. Alrighty, Bell. So these are the headphones. I'm actually using these headphones. I switched up from my old headphones to these headphones, so I can still hear everything outside of my of my area. I can hear my own voice. So I don't know how good the noise canceling issue is, but because I think it's because of how my, big my ears are they can't get a good seal on uh, around my ears and to be honest from the size of my ears these are more uncomfortable than than my, my, my main headphones um for me personally 
Uh, I built pretty much, if you have small ears, this is going to be the most comfortable for you. They feel, feel comfy, like I can press on and I can feel that they're, they're doing their job. Just with my ears, it just kind of makes it uncomfortable, specifically for me. Not, I'm not speaking for anyone else, but I don't know how the audio quality is. Hopefully, this is how I'm, I'm speaking directly through this mic. I'm not speaking through any other mic. My original headset is unplugged, and this is the main part where audio is coming out. When I hear audio, like it's not that gr it's actually pretty good. Actually, the audio is really, really so good that I, I enjoyed the, the, the bass. It was pretty okay, got spot on. It felt really nice. The audio is pretty good. The only thing that I can tell from just viewing my, my OBS software is that just me speaking, it will pick up everything that's outside of my uh, that, I, that I can hear. But if I can't hear it, say if I have thing, anything that's outside that the mic pick up, the mic will pick it up, regardless if, there's, if it's dead silent. I think it has to do with AGC. AGC is basically a, a little software of the, the, the driver that determines, basically what it is, is basically determines the sensitivity of your mic based on the environment, outside environment, and what's happening currently inside on your, while you're on your computer. Fortunately, I had to turn that off, that crap off, because usually I have it on with my main mic, because my main mic can do it very well, but this mic just doesn't do it very well, so, uh, and the microphone was set at 92. Even at 92, OBS was still detecting outside noise. Um, and I had to turn it down to 50, because what would happen is that when I, I would play Spotify, and I'd play music, and then I would look at the footage um, to see if the music is actually being picked up, in the in in the mic, and apparently so it is, and I can't have any music playing because I just because you know copyright. I don't want your copyright. This video needs uh, uh, this video is being monetized. I don't want to get demonetized for just audio that plays through Spotify. Um, uh, it does support Dolby Dolby Atomos, so that's that's a good thing. Dolby Atomos. I have a program on on my computer called Dolby Atomos, which you can improve the audio and do EQ equalizing it and improving enhancing the audio um, visuality of it and it actually worked really well I had no issues with it um, the USB which I can show you actually does if you look at the USB USB A instead of USB C it actually does have a, a blue LED I think the other one that does too but this has different modes I've tried different modes on this and they look I don't know exactly what the mode does because oh it does come with the paperwork <laughs> but it, it, this is not a great I wouldn't say this is a great headset um, I'm going to switch to my own main headset and hopefully it goes well so here is my conclusion so actually and I forgot to mention that these do extend if you have if your ear death is much lower than your head so if you need more um, it can go up to four. I mean, I personally, I personally highly like these headphones because they go much more longer than that. So that's why I like personal light. But these headphones are great for audio. Like they're great to listen to audio. They're great to listen to to music and stuff like that. But they what 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 lacks in in these headphones is the mic quality and the mic how the noise canceling of audio is just terrible. Unless there's some kind of software that that can help assist me with this and assist me of making it much more improved. I don't think this is a good buy. Um, if you were going to plan to buy this, it is good for the if if you're looking for a cheaper if you're looking for a cheaper option. It's I think it's like forty bucks on Amazon. Um, I'll have the link in the description where you can definitely check uh, in the in there so you can buy it yourself if you want to if you want to purchase it uh, yourself. And I recommend this as a like. You know, I recommend this more as like listening to music and stuff like that and audio. But when it comes to speaking through a mic with it, it's it's not the greatest in the department. And I would definitely not go use, buy these headphones to go talk to somebody if you're playing if you're in a game unless you unless you're going for a cheap op alternative option and this is the only thing you got. And I would go for these, but if you can go for much more higher quality and much more. If noise canceling efficiency. I would go for something that much more expensive, and save 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 a headache.
because of these. In my personal opinion, these are uncomfortable to me. I cannot wear these for like I could the whole time I was recording with these. I just hated it. Um, I just have two big ears, which is the main reason why I hated them. They're they're very comfortable when it comes to the padding, but just my because of my ears, these make my ears feel like as I just don't want to put these on ever again. The audio is great. My I don't know. I can tell I, it probably will sound good by the time I, I make this video, and it probably will. Maybe not. You can tell. You, you can be the judge to it. But um, it's not the greatest because it can pick up. I can pick up audio sounds outside, and I can still be able to hear. And with my ears, if I can still hear anything outside of my ear, um, then it it's not the headset for me specifically. It's more of the choice of a person who has much more smaller ears and who can who can't afford a, a a big amount of headsets. Now, do I highly do I recommend this? I can't I can't, I can't recommend this to a gamer who rely heavily relies on communication and uh, and full audio and comfortability. And that's what my needs are. I, I rely heavily rely on audio, rely on the comf being com being very comfortable, and I also have rely on having a good mic so whenever I communicate with my teammates or my friends, I can talk to them without having background noise happening because you know there's always going to be background noise happening and I just can't stop that. So if um if these are not going to do the job, then there's no point of using them. Um, but I do recommend these if you are. One a one uh, for for a few reasons. If one you're 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 on the very cheap side kind of guy or person, and you really want to go the cheapest option, you don't care how how crappy it is as long as it's a good option and it fits and, and it fits comfortable and you have small ears and stuff like that, you'll be fine with these headphones. If you don't really care about the about talking into these constantly and these being your primary mic, that then these are great headphones for you because these are great for like listening to music and on the go. They have really great audio quality. They have, they have. A, I think this is a mode button because when I pressed it, I thought it was the mute button, another mute button, but it wasn't. It was mode, and I think it just changes audio IQ and stuff like that. But uh, I'm not 100 percent sure. I have to look at the manual. But if I, yeah, so hopefully, uh, I'll let that know in the in the comments if it's a mode, if it's a mode thing, but or description. I'll do the description. Um, but I would not use this as your primary communication headset. I would just use this as regular headphones. These actually work way really cool. I, would, I wouldn't even use these. I wouldn't personally use these at all. Um, probably give this to like, uh, if I if I could, I would probably give, this, I'm gonna give this to probably a femme member or something because this is just boo-boo. I Mike is crap because it can pick up audio off audio, but music, audio. Pretty good, but comfortably for my ears. Nope, because I have big ears and these ain't gonna these ain't gonna cut it. If you want to buy this product and and you also enjoy this video, please leave a like on this video and subscribe for for future videos. Um, Bellatories, if you're watching this video, there's it could be a good headset, but it just needs more. There needs to be a software that I can utilize for it. That I can mitigate the mitigate the ambient sounds and the noise the noise coming outside of the in, that's coming from the room because if that's if if my my OBS can detect ambient sounds because there's a there's like a green bar that, there's like a bar that tells you green is good yellow is a little too high red is really high of volume and it's just going back and forth like like if it's like there's like it's picking up sound then it needs to be there's something needs to be done it does just, just there's there's have to be some way to do it if you have a software you can provide me or have a where i can link people to to get that software then i think that would be the better option but right now i just don't see any valuable reason to to highly recommend this for a gamer who i believe lies on communication audio and comfortability unless they have really small ears, then comfortability wouldn't be a problem. But the two things that are issue is the 
the mic issue and the oh, oh, the mic issue and all these other things. And I completely forgot what the other issue. I don't know. But if you guys did enjoy this video, please like this video. If you want to buy that product and you want to check it out for yourself and you're looking for a cheap option, I think this video is one for you. And you don't really care about if you don't care about communication as much. I guess it's has it for you. Uh, see you guys later.